All right, so we are now completing the right side of our patient's um, lumbar facet blocks. However, instead of using traditional steroids, we're actually using platelet-rich plasma, which is derived from the patient's own blood, essentially. And it's a great option, picture, to essentially get rid of a lot of inflammation and create some new tissue and growth um, within the, the joint spaces itself. And this has helped with a lot of other patients within our practice, picture. And this is something that, unfortunately, insurance doesn't really cover. So we use a lot of patients' um, health saving accounts or even just their own, their own hard-earned uh, cash and credit cards, so to speak, in order to do this procedure. And most people, despite having to pay an okay amount of money for it, are very happy with the results thereafter. So we're just placing the last needle right now. Picture. And we're just going to put a little bit of highlighting medicine or contrast material on here to just basically see if we are indeed in the actual joint spaces here. And we are using a fluoroscopic x ray machine to confirm that. I'm just going to adjust one of them here just to get a little bit of a better read. That is better. So here it is. This is platelet rich plasma, PRP. This is not just the whole blood of the patient, but this is basically a concentrated portion of the blood. Whereas we put the whole blood into a centrifuge and spin it for 15 minutes. And this is the portion of the blood that has all the concentrated growth factors, which will bring stem cells to the region, which will produce more cartilage and basically promote good inflammation. That way, the specific body part heals. We're just going to put one cc in each of these joints here. And then on the way out, I have a little bit of another section of blood called platelet poor plasma that does contain a good amount of growth factor in here as well, just not as much as the other, just to kind of give the needle track a little bit of something here. And kind of help promote some good inflammation in those areas as well. And that's it.